Hi, right, question number 5, the curve with equation 6e to the 2x plus ke to the y plus e to the 2y is equal to c, where k and c are constants, passes through the point p with coordinates ln3 and ln2. Show that 58 plus 2k is equal to c. Second part, given also that the gradient of the curve at p is minus 6, find the values of k and c. Good, so here is the equation. We need to show that... Um, 58 plus 2k is equal to c. Right. So we're going to substitute. So this is x, this is y. So x goes in here, we got c e to the 2x 2 times ln 3 because x is ln 3 plus k. e to the y which is ln 2 plus e to ln 2 is equal to c. y is ln 2, ln 2. So ln 3 to the square is 9. So we've got 9 times 6 is 9. 9 times 6, ln e is 1, so times 1, plus 2k, alright, plus 2 to the power of 2 is 4, 4 times ln e is 4, let's go to c, 9 times 6 is 54, plus 4, plus 2k, let's go to c, that means 58 plus 2k is equal to c, shown. For the second part, we are told that the gradient, that is dy by dx, at the point p is minus 6. Therefore, we're going to differentiate the curve. So d dx, but 6e to the 2x plus k e to the y plus e to the 2y is equal to c. d dx c. Right, differentiating this, 2 times 6 is 12. e to the 2x, 2 ln 3 because x is ln3 plus differentiating y, this is implicit fraction, you're going to get dy by dx, so I got then dy by dx times k times 1 um, e to the y plus e to the 2y, so we're going to get then 2e and y is an implicit, fra implicit fraction, so differentiating y, we're going to get dy by dx and not to forget the power, 2y is equal to differentiating, differentiating a constant, you're going to get 0. So 3 to the square is 9, 9 times 12, 108. ln is 1, 1 times 108 is 108. e to the y, and y here is ln 2. Okay, so ln 2 is then 2 times k is 2k, so we've got plus 2k dy by dx is minus 6 as given here so we're going to, we're going to get minus 6 plus minus 6 times 2 ln e is 1 k times 1 plus then you get 2 to the ln 2 so 2 to the square is 4 4 times 2 is 8 8 times minus 6 is minus 48 and that's going to give us a zero. Okay, so we got then 108 minus 48 minus 12k is equal to zero. This minus is 60 minus 12k is equal to zero. 12k is equal to 60, meaning that k is going to be 60 divided by 12. Therefore, k is equal to 5. We found the value of k. Now we need to find the value of c. C is equal to 58 plus 2k, so C is going to be then 58 plus 2 times 5, which is 10. C is equal to 58 plus 10, and therefore we got then C is equal to 60. So this is uh, question number 5, taken from June 2011, um, Advanced Level Maths HSC P3.